White blood cells are predominantly involved in fighting infections and participating in inflammatory reactions, while red blood cells carry oxygen to the body. Platelets help stop bleeding. The normal number of white blood cell ranges from around 4 to 11 billion cells per liter. Newborn babies have a higher range, from around 9 to 30 billion cells per liter, which goes down over the first two years of life and is similar to adult normal ranges for the rest of childhood. Opposed to red blood cells, the normal range is not affected by gender. However, it is affected by race. In national studies, African Americans have lower baseline white blood cell counts than Caucasians. There are several different ways to categorize white blood cell disorders. First, they can be categorized by cause, those that affect white blood cell production and other factors that affect the function of the white blood cell. Secondly, white blood cell disorders might be categorized by which type of white blood cell is affected. In some disorders, all the white blood cells are affected, but others only affect one type. There are five major types of white blood cells. Neutrophils, which predominantly fight bacterial infections, lymphocytes, which predominantly fight viral infections, monocytes, which predominantly fight fungal infections, eosinophils, which predominantly fight parasitic infections and are involved in allergic reactions, and basophils, which are involved in inflammatory reactions. Thirdly, white blood cell disorders can be classified as benign or malignant. The majority of white blood cell disorders are benign. Generally, too much of one type of white blood cell is suffixed with philia on the end of the word, and too few of one type of white blood cell is suffixed with penia, which is applicable to all types of white blood cells. For instance, leukophilia is a white blood cell count above the normal range, and leukopenia is a white blood cell count below the normal range. These can also be applied scientific white blood cells, such as neutropenia, with too few neutrophils, or basophilia, with too many basophils. Leukophilia is an increased number of white blood cells. The most common causes are infection, medications like prednisone. Autoimmune neutropenia occurs when the body secretes antibodies that attack and destroy neutrophils. Patients with severe congenital neutropenia are born with severe neutropenia secondary to genetic mutation and have recurrent bacterial infections. Cyclic neutropenia is caused due to genetic mutation similar to severe congenital neutropenia. However, the neutropenia does not occur every day but in cycles of about 21 days. Leukemia is a cancerous white blood cells produced in the bone marrow. Chronic granulomatous disease is a disorder where multiple types of white blood cells become unable to function properly. It is an inherited condition and results in multiple infections, particularly pneumonia and abscesses. Leukocyte adhesion deficiency is a disorder where the white blood cells are unable to move areas of infection.